Um, so what are uh, some of the things that you're currently exploring in terms of design? Um, some new ideas? Uh, I guess when I'm, I'm, the things I'm exploring in design is I'm trying to not just, it's not just a design problem, it's really, again, I'm trying to figure out how to find the optimistic client in this economic environment we have that is getting the city, enjoying the city, willing to sort of be opportunistic with the low construction costs we have right now in places, and, you know, look at the, the, the spine of, of, of light rail, and I'm looking for that chance within walking distance of light rail stops to really become part now with that backbone in place of, of, of creating some new vital living nodes in our city. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that really interests me. Mm -hmm. uh, that sort of thing will be collaborative in nature. It mm -hmm. won't be just one architect building a, mm -hmm. uh, a landmark. It's mm -hmm. going to be setting up a, a comfortable conversation that is creating a place of the authenticity of materials and light and the, and, and the civic place that I believe exists here. Mm -hmm. And with those examples, I think we can you know, really get people refocusing on that possibility and not thinking about, sadly, the, the, the lot out in the desert somewhere to build the individual house that they feel is a lost opportunity. Mm -hmm. You know, if we could show how good garden desert living can be, and I've tried in some of the multiples that I've worked on, there's a project in Tempe called The Vale down on University. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. That's what dense living looks like. Mm -hmm. It's mixed use, there's some entrepreneurs there, so there's a little cafe there, mm -hmm. there's a garden courtyard, there's carriage houses and walk-ups and two-story townhouses, and there's 13 different plans you can have, and that project that is no more than four stories with some underground parking, that's actually the density of Brooklyn. That's one of these scary density places. Wow. Okay. Yes. And so if we could build a project like the Vale, two blocks in a four block square, mm -hmm. and again, that's four to five stories like I was talking about. Mm -hmm. We could get, create quality garden living like that. At every, there's 25 light rail stops right now. Mm -hmm. So if you build at that density, we could add a million people in population mm. at 25 stops without serious impact to the infrastructure of sewers and roads and all this stuff. Mm -hmm. And we create a pretty interesting neighborhood. Yeah. That'd be pretty remarkable. Right. So right now, what am I wanting to do design-wise? I'm wanting to, to make some building blocks that become part of this these new downtown neighborhoods that mm -hmm. really are spirited by light rail. Mm -hmm. We sort of were slow on the blocks, and it was a little bit partly the economy at the time, but everybody sort of was betting that light rail wouldn't work as well as it is. Yeah. And it's exceeded all expectations. Right. And I have moved to where I, I walk out my front door yes. and I get on the train. Okay, it's 150 feet from my door. Mm -hmm. And it's really changed the way. You know, I don't think I'd, I'd still be here if I didn't have this chance to really live in the city that I've always dreamed of being. Mm -hmm. And so back to that question. Mm -hmm. you know, so, but mm -hmm. the big design idea is, you know, how can we bring what has been a a career of of more buildings than neighborhoods into the fact of really coalescing into this uh, this rich fabric. You know, mm -hmm. I'd, I'd I'd love uh, to have the the empty infill lot. Mm -hmm. You know, I want mm -hmm. to be with a curb and a facade and a sidewalk and a street. Mm -hmm. You know, Central comes sort of close to that, but at one level, Central Library here is somewhat still a suburban building yeah. on the edge of a park in a parking lot right. on the main street of our city. Yes. So it is and it isn't. It's, it's the unique thing of this place and no other. Right. And uh, it is the, the marker that it was designed to be. Yes. 